Hashem is limitless and boundless, and all Hashem wants is our benefit. Hashem created the entire cosmos, everything in creation for us, for us to grow, for us to accomplish, not because we're worthy, not because we're good, not because we're deservant. I'm deservant of nothing. Before I existed, I didn't exist. I didn't do anything to make it worthy for Hashem to exist, to make me exist. And when I exist, there's nothing I could do to pay back Hashem. Hashem keeps me alive with one thing only, chesed, grace. Hashem is the giver, Hashem is the native. Hashem wants me to succeed. Hashem doesn't get angry, Hashem doesn't lose patience. And the more I understand that, the more as I get closer to Hashem, and I recognize that Hashem is the shofar, I recognize, yes, it's a very grave and serious thing we're going to stand on Rosh Hashanah. I'm going to be judged. And the judgment is across the gamut. Every human being on the planet, every issue of the coming year is decided. The stakes are high, but I have one ace in the hole. It's my God, my creator, Avinu Makenu, who is the Shofi, the one who loves me more than I love me, the one who doesn't lose patience, the one who doesn't get angry. And all he wants is one thing for me to grow, for me to change, for me to do tshuva. Let's go. The more I get it, the more I see the gravity, the more I recognize the Shofi is my, I can't say my best friend, more than my best friend, my beloved, my, my Hashem, God, who loves me, who only wants everything for me, who created me just to give to me and who waits patiently, with infinite patience for me to finally wake up. Dread, despondent, depression, those words have no connection to the Avodah. 